Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. Today on Collection Lessons, I want to talk about the business again. This is the second one. Um, this is part of the Collection Lessons series. Anything I say on this channel is not anything advice. And let's get into it. So the previous business, if you want to look back on my first business, I like to just explain a business model and um, share how it's different or not so different from other things you may have heard of, as well as just see it in a different view. So we're going to do a little um, fun, a little storytelling, a little uh, story time type thing and uh, let's get into it so what I want to talk about in this business is you know I have this great business idea so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get people and we're gonna get a bunch of people so we'll just like say this amount of this amount of people so this is everybody waiting in line we're gonna get all these people right what are we gonna do we're gonna sign them up okay let's say it's about I don't know let's just sign them up to uh, a $60 per year um, membership that's sixty dollars per year and we'll call it a membership right so in this membership what do they get access to well let's just say um, you know I create a, uh, a store like this and they get access to my store right and uh, in this business model um, you know, we're, we're basically, it's just access to the store and they get stuff basically, uh, you know, we'll just maybe sell some, um, I don't know, like some food, you know, just like a normal store and we'll sell some, um, clothing, you know, um, and then some household items, whatever you want, right? So that's what we're going to do at the store, but we're going to, we're going to make them pay a membership fee to get into the store because, you know, people like my stuff. So that's what we're going to do. And we're going to say like, this is how the, the business makes money is basically from all these memberships because you know people pay them and uh that's all we're gonna do right like i mean we're gonna put like a 10 percent markup on on all these things right um you know the food and the clothing and the household items because you know we need to pay for the store but in order to pay for the employees that we're gonna have in the store um they're basically gonna get paid from the membership right so people are gonna get into this thing and, uh, you know, it's like, hey, do you want to go to the store? Well, do you have membership? No, it's like, I'll sign you up, right? And um, what does that kind of sound like? Well, I mean, you know, it's it's not really a hype up sign up, but I mean, people could call it that. It's almost like, well, you know, one of these structures where, you know, people will pay all these memberships into here, into this thing. And at the top, we'll call it the CEO, right? He's going to make all the money because he's at the top of this, you know, triangular structure. Meanwhile, all these people that are down here are just at the bottom, right? They're not, they can, they're going to justify to themselves, you know, as this bottom layer that they're, um, they're going to be making money is what we're going to say. They're saving money to buy these items because we only mark it up 10%, not like, you know, you know, those traditional stores that it's like 30, 40% markup. We don't do that. We only do 10%. So people are going to be like, they're not going to think about this membership and they're going to be thinking, well, I'm making money. Because I shop at this store, I pay sixty dollars a year, sure, but I get sixty dollars more in value the more I shop at this store, right? So, like, like let's say they they spend I don't know, um, let's say ten grand a year, you know, through my store, and you know it only costs sixty bucks, you know, but they save, let's say two k a year. Well, who's gonna pay sixty, you know, sixty bucks a year to save two k? Everyone, right? I, that's why I think this is a great kind of business model and they're going to justify to themselves you know that they're making money they're going to be here but meanwhile you know me the ceo or whoever at the top of this triangular structure is going to be making money i'm sure we got like employees in, in here right like actual employees that you know work at the store but you know what does that kind of sound like what is a 60 year membership you know people aren't going to think of it any different but what it's actually called is like like this it's actually called costco doesn't that sound funny? 80% of the money made is through membership fees. 80% is through membership fee. The remaining other 10% comes from, um, you know, the actual sales because, you know, they got to supply whatever and they got overhead as well. And um, the other one is just investments. Um, but... 80% comes from membership fees. Doesn't that blow your mind? It's it's interesting. Why is this normal? You know, that people pay $60 a year for a membership at Costco. 
and you know they get food and everything and yeah they'll justify to high heaven themselves that oh i'm saving 2k spending 10k at the store why don't people just create their own store why don't people just create you know their own online based business and just pay you know 60 bucks a year to run it have no employees no overhead of that you make 10 percent on everything that you sell why don't people just do that and it's weird how costco has done this and it's normal but you know any you know i'll call it a small based business any of those home businesses um you know that you know people call it network marketing or whichever why is it so different why is costco any different you know oh the people above me the people that got me into costco you know they're not making money well they're keeping the business in check right they're keeping it you know running with their money you know like let's say you know you're your friend is like, hey man, I, you know, I go to Costco, it's $60 a year, why don't you come to Costco with me and we'll get you signed up and you can have all these sweet deals just like I do. It's weird. Why, why is this normal? 80%, they've released this every year. 80% of all Costco's revenue comes from membership fees. Yet people are worried about hype up sign up deals with, you know, other people or people, you know, have online based businesses with no overhead and it's, you know, oh, they only make money from these, you know, people getting in at the bottom of this you know triangular structure yet you, you got the ceo you got management you got leaders you got team leads you got people doing the cashiers you got employees stocking the shelves and then there's people that throw themselves at the bottom of this structure justifying themselves that they're making 2k because they're um, paying 60 dollars a year and they're they're saving 2k a year therefore they're making almost 2k it's it's a funny business model if you think of it like this and that's what i want to share with this video and these type of series of the business is you take a normal let's call it quote normal business that you know and hear of that you love or whichever and uh you just kind of expose it in a different light and uh it's just funny and um yeah that's what i want to share with this video this one's called the business it's the second one it talks about this business model and how most of its revenue is from membership fees and it's normal and it's okay so that's it for this video. Thanks and talk soon.